Good day guys, Bing here. Um, today we're, uh, we're going to try this. So we're going to use model text uh, in and load it into a uh, ballast family and then load it into the uh, project and then and create a railing. Okay, so let's start. So first we need to create a generic model. So this in this generic generic model we are going to create a model text. So um, I'm going to use a lowercase a and edit type duplicate so create a new type and then I'll use this uh, wing this one. Of course you can you can change this one to uh, any font so you can also download some interesting uh, Found okay, so um, and size, um, not sure one, one hundred or oh, one meter. <laughs> okay, so yeah, so this is this is it. So now we need to uh, let, let's just try to align this to a center and also this direction. And where is it? Oh, here, uh, looks like a little bit too low. We need to move it up roughly just yeah that's um that's good so uh i just want to check because um the railing i think it's probably it's like one meter high and i want to make sure this is uh um, enough uh, big enough so roughly uh current is 700 so maybe we need increase this a little bit um so let's try one 700 four five zero okay so let's have a look okay so it's, it's it's roughly one meter so now just to move this uh roughly to the center and i think that's all good so now we go to um go to property uncheck the always vertical and check the uh word plan based okay so this one is for oh, hell and also change the thickness you can give it a material if you wanted to so now we can go create a new family so this time it will be a baluster okay so in this baluster so so see this is a left view okay so left elevation so first we need to find the middle point okay so so we're going to create a reference plan dimension and equal so here so this is it and then we need to create a reference line uh, we need to pick a, a word plan so we're going to pick the center left to right okay so we we we, uh, we will be able to create a reference line in this view okay so go here center left right click ok so now we can create a reference line yep reference line from this point just parallel to these two di angle this one this one and select this angle and um, use the slope angle okay so and this is it so now we can load that font uh, the mo model text into this baluster family and then use place on word plan okay and go here pick a word plan pick a plan okay pick this word plan so move your cursor onto this reference line space 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 okay so and i'm going to just place it here so um and also i'll change this baluster height to uh, maybe one meter so we can uh, roughly get uh, an idea about the size i think it's quite okay slightly big, big then but i think that should be all, all good um now we can um i think that's it so then we can create a project okay so um create a project and we're going to load this baluster family into the project 
go balustra family load into project okay so now let's create a railing finish go to 3d view so select this railing edit type duplicate uh, let's call it new and okay so now we're going to so we're going to keep the top rail and um yeah all good uh baluster so edit so first we need to increase the spacing of the baluster so currently they are uh, 275 uh spacing right so we're going to increase so, uh, it will be one meter it's about 1.5 meter or 1.5 a so I'll try, try 1.7 okay and then uh, change this one to the new family we did and also uh, we are not sure about this but we don't need this and uh, we're going to just remove all these okay so okay 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 so it seems we need to uh, increase the the spacing so we go edit type and maybe let's try two meter apply okay apply yeah that's better so now um if we uh, let's try let's if i create a floor finish and select this railing pick new hole host and pick the floor so if I do modi modify sub element, so you will see this railing will follow my floor. Okay, good. And let's try stairs. M A. Yes, good. And also um, ramp. M A. Good. So you will see, uh, you can see that the angle will, al will always match the, um, the slope of floor, stairs, and ramp. And if you want to change, so actually, um, I um, I did uh, try to to create a, a size parameter and try to use the um, top rail height to control the size of the font but uh, it didn't work i'm not sure why but you can have a try <laughs> so to to change the size so for example if i want to change the size of this or if i want to change a different um different text so you need to go here so under this um project browser a family railing here so you will see the family here so right click edit so this is the baluster family so we, we need to go deeper so we need to select this one edit family so now we can change the uh, everything about this text so for example we can change the material you can change the thick uh, depths the thickness so you can change the font uh, you can so for example I'll just uh, change it okay so yeah this is okay so just move it to center <laughs> okay so now we can load this into that um, baluster family overwrite and then load this into the project and overwrite okay so then that's it okay so um yeah that's um that's it for today uh if you have any questions please let me know uh if you have you can also um ask questions here so if you have any questions please just type here or just paste uh post image here i will answer you as so as i can Okay, so thank you. I'll see you next time. Bye.